Okay, so we're going to read and solve this question together. Because I'm, I'm probably going to zoom in on this graph so you can see things um, as we go. Uh, but let's start by reading it. The graph below shows the variation in the average temperature of the Earth's surface from 1950 to 2000, according to one source. So we have from 1950 to 2000, the average variation in temperature. So you can see that in some cases it's below the average than it is the average. And then so there's no change, zero. Then there's going down, way below. And then it's staying constant. And then um, we have this steady rise here in uh, the average variation. So the variation on the surface, surface of the Earth is increasing there over time, which I think uh, speaks to global warming. During which years the temperature variation changed the most per unit time? Explain how you determined your answer. They're essentially asking, uh, where is this? Where is the slope in this graph the steepest? And you might be able to see it, but let's just verify that the steepest slope is between 1960, so that's going up to this point, 1960 to this point, to 1965 here. And let's calculate it, right? At 1960, um, we're at zero. And then here, at 1965, uh, we are at negative 1.5. All right, so how would we calculate slope there? Well, m is going to be equal to uh, the difference in y, so uh, 0 minus negative 1.5, which is just 1.5. And then uh, 19, you, could, you could do 1960 minus 1965, but I'm going to say that uh, this is starting at 1950 right here, so we can think of that as 0. And then 1955 is going up 5 years, 1960 10 years, so this is, just, this is like 10, 0. And then 1965 is like 15, 0, uh, 15, negative 1.5, so it's 10 minus 15, right? And you have 1.5 over negative 5, right? And you can calculate this. So let's grab my calculator. So here, negative, oh, sorry. So it's 1.5 divided by negative, the sign down here, 5 equals negative 0.3, right? So you can say that, and you can, you can do this for all the other examples, you can see that this whole section right here is constant, so pick any points on it. That's the only thing that seems to be close here. You can also try this section right here. You will never get a slope uh, that is steeper than negative 0.3. There will be no absolute value that's higher or lower than that. Uh, sorry, higher than that. Um, so it's the steepest negative slope. right? You can say that to explain your work and also give uh, the value of the slope that you found. All right, hope this helped.